the Duchess of Sussex has withdrawn an application to trademark her Archetypes podcast, just months after Spotify confirmed a second series would not be coming out. Meghan Markle's last-ditch attempt to save her Archetypes podcast has failed, with a 17-month battle to protect its name now reportedly withdrawn. The move comes just months after Spotify pulled the plug on the multi-million pound deal confirming back in June it would not host a second season of the podcast. A joint statement from Archul and the music streamer said they had mutually agreed to part ways, but unconfirmed reports suggested there was not enough content packaged into the podcast to warrant a full pay out. An application had been lodged in March 2022 with the U.S. Patent and Trademark Office which detailed parent, company Archie Wells bid to keep the archetype's name, despite the axe deal. Meghan and Harry sought to claim rights to archetypes in areas such as downloadable audio recordings and podcasts and in anything that fell into the category of cultural treatment of women and stereotypes facing women. But this has now been withdrawn, the Daily Mail reports, after a period of just under a year and a half. Within 10 months, Meghan had received her first set, back, with the U.S. toe rejecting the claim based on confusion it would cause with an existing trademark with the same name. According to the Mail, the name actually already existed with another U.S. company called Project Miracle IP Holdings, back in May 2018. An extension saw their response time delayed until July, just one month after Spotify spectacularly dropped the podcast altogether. Meghan and Harry's lawyer Marjorie Wither Norman, from the L.A.-based firm Wilkie, Far Gallagher, re, applied for an extra three months to finesse the application, which takes them up to September. Archetypes produced just 12 episodes in its prime, where former actress Megan had spoken to a range of high-profile figures to explore and subvert the labels that try to hold women back. It had even been topping global podcast charts, drawing an estimated 11 million listeners per week. But interest soon dropped off, and, by the 10th episode, the show had plunged to 22nd on Spotify's U.S. rankings. Despite the podcast now in the past, Prince Harry and Meghan still have lucrative deals they can lean on. Among those are a multi-million pound deal with Netflix, and another with Penguin Random House. Meghan is also tipped to revive her Instagram following once again, with an account with the handle at Meghan tipped to belong to the Duchess of Sussex.